Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Moonlit and Polished. In this episode, I'm going to show you how I did these strips of pink over hollow nails. I'm not really good at the naming of the nail polishes designs, you know, I'm, I try to come up with cool names, but I'm really not that great at it. So uh, I used ColourPop's One Wish, Two Wish, and I did two coats as a base. I wanted to actually do a glittery color, but I realized I actually don't have a lot of glitter nail polish. I think I have three colors and none of them were what I wanted. So it looks like I'm going to have to expand my glitter polish collection. Either way, this one worked out pretty well because I do like it and I've been waiting for a design to use it with. And once you have two coats on, you're going to go ahead and put a coat of top coat. And now you're going to pick your four colors. I have Assistant Awesome, Weekend Getaway, Orchid Around, and Be Very Afraid. Assistant Awesome I got at Walmart and I can't find it on the website. I don't know why they don't have this on their website for sale. But it's $2.49 at the store and I do recommend it. Like when you see me put the color down on this plastic mat, it's so pigmented. It's such a good nail polish for $2.49. I mean, look at that. that it's that third one right there. And it's such a good pigmented color and the leveling agents in it are just amazing. For $2.49, I mean, you really can't go wrong. I did two coats of each of these and then I went ahead and put a clear nail polish over it. And then I set it aside to dry for a while, about 15 to 20 minutes. Once it's dry, you can go ahead and peel the little decals off of the mat. And next I just took a pair of scissors and I just cut really thin strips. I cut them all into teeny tiny thin strips and then I went ahead and I lined them up according to have the order color I wanted for each of the nails. It's just faster if you do this, you know, for all five of the nails at once. That way you're not trying to sort through them while you're doing each individual nail. It's all kind of laid out for you and ready. And next I put a clear coat, just a regular clear nail polish, not a top coat just to make my nail wet. And then I just started to place the strips where I wanted them to go. This this first one is Be Fairy Afraid. The next one is Orchid Around. Then next up we have Weekend Getaway. And finally we have Assistant Awesome. I just kind of wanted this sort of zigzaggy shape where they're all kind of touching each other but kind of going off kilter in different ways. And I don't know, I just thought of this honestly. Last night while I was falling asleep, I thought of it and I was like, oh, I guess that's what I'll do with my nails tomorrow. And then I started snoring because I'm a real person who snores. So you're just gonna cut off the excess and I used a cleanup brush with acetone to kind of get the edges to stick as best I could to the nail polish sides and such and and getting rid of any extra that, you know, is hanging off. And then finally you put a top coat on it. That's right. Seal it in and then you're done. Mm. I ended up doing blues on my right hand and pinks on my left hand and I really like it. Got a lot of compliments for it. So this is the final result. I hope you guys like it. That's all I have for you today. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.